There's something about worship before we ever deal with anything that exalts who God is. We get, we don't make God bigger when we worship him, but we get to see his greatness. And it is from that perspective that we begin to transact in the spirit. When we are conscious of the one that we are dealing with. Once we are conscious that this one is not a fragmentation of our imagination. He's not an imaginary figure. But he is real. He is real. Worship gives us that opportunity to see him. To see him, to be aware of him. Jesus Christ is alive. He's alive. He's alive. He says, I am he who was alive and was dead, but behold, I live forevermore. He's alive. He requires a generation to see him. When you see him, everything becomes a shadow. When you see him, everything becomes a shadow. The strength of whatever you were seeing will become but a shadow when you see him. Suddenly you realize that this thing is not as big as I thought. You realize that greater is the one who is within us. You suddenly see his greatness. You realize why Jesus said my father is greater than all. He's greater than any circumstance. He's greater than any problem. He's greater than any government. He's greater than any principality. He is unmatched. Unmatched, uncontested. The king, eternal, immortal, invisible, the only wise God. The one who is able to keep you from falling. Able to secure you from falling. There's nobody like Jesus. Jesus. 